Hello and welcome back to the training. In this video, we are going to show you how to set up your default notebook. Now, the default notebook, in my opinion, should be what we call your inbox because this is where all of the notes are going to go by default. If you email a note without a notebook, it's going to go to the default notebook. If you create a note on your iPhone, iPad, Android without a a notebook it's automatically going to go to your default notebook now what I've done is labeled my default notebook inbox as you can see now if you notice I put an exclamation point in front of the inbox the reason why I did that was so that the inbox shows up at the top of my notebook lists all the time because as you can see they're in alphabetical order if I just labeled it inbox my inbox would be in the middle of everything so you just put the exclamation point right in front of it and it pops right on up there to the top for you now <clears throat> this is how you will identify your notebook as the default notebook what you want to do is hover over the notebook you want to be your default right click and then come down to properties when you come down to properties click on that and that will allow you to rename it if you want to rename it but also look at this check mark right here make this my default notebook if you don't have a default notebook checked you check that okay now let's look right here we go to properties and we can click on this action make this my default notebook so I click there that makes that my default notebook now obviously I want my <laughs> default to be the inbox so I'm gonna click here and that that's gonna change it back to the default so as you can see you can also change your your default inbox really or notebook really easily as well, well my suggestion is name it inbox and put an exclamation point now everything in here I need to sort tag and put in a different uh, notebook so it's as easy as that guys like I said Evernote's an easy tool to use but and but it's kind of confusing but once you master it it's like an extension of your brain and you, and you can use it to never forget a thing ever again thanks again my name's Shannon and as always hopefully I'll see you on the beaches of the world Hey, thank you very much for checking out our Evernote training. If you want more, just click on the playlist annotation to the right. It says click here for the playlist, and that will give you access to all of our Evernote training listed publicly here on YouTube. Now, if you would like a little bit more, on the left, you can click on that link and get access to some privately listed Evernote training videos that we have that is exclusive on our website. You can get access to that as well by clicking on the annotation to the left. Thank you once again, and as always, hopefully I'll see you on the beaches of the world.